All right, well, we get the new the new catalyst ride here. Got the opportunity to ride with with you guys. It's pretty cool and um, beautiful weather. A little hard to see at the flat light, but other than that, um, it's always good when there's snow on the ground. And visiting Roger Skyms Ranch is just a uh, icing on the cake because it uh, what better place than than Sky, Minnesota to debut the new Arctic Cat Catalyst. So um, this here is the Riot. So this is the crossover version of our Catalyst. It's got the 39 inch front suspension. That's kind of an all around front front ski stance for um, for off trail, getting in between trees, but also some stability on the trails with the sway bar. Different, uh, or the trail spindles in there. So it's it's got very good trail manners, but when you get off trail with the 146 inch cross action rear suspension and track combination there it's it really stays on top of the snow and it and allows you to go through some some of the deep stuff but uh, very playful especially with the new design it's a centralized design so as much of the weight of the snowmobile is centered as possible so that when you're sitting on the sled and or standing on the sled and riding you know, you're basically on top of most of the weight of the snowmobile so that you can maneuver and do your different different uh, um, off trail type mannerisms but even when you're on the trail and you're getting in the corners it's biting so you can get forward get back it just it's kind of a, a sled that does everything that you want it to do and kind of an extension of the body and the way the the body panels work you can get up really tight if you want to or or even lock your knees in there if you're going downhill or if you just want to feel more stable as you're going through the bumps you can get really tight with the sleds um, one thing that i really like about this model as well is the steering system and how you feel when you're sitting with it it's very natural so that you can get get into the corners with the with more of the lay down post but but still tall enough that when you're standing you gotta you feel real comfortable but what also is very special about this model is how the post is it's centered to the snowmobile which is great but down at the bottom there's a progressive steering system so basically as you turn initially it's very easy to turn so it's it really it doesn't cause any fatigue and you feel like you have so much control and then as you corner the progressive steering the arm essentially gets longer so then it's it's you know normal steering as you're getting into it so it's just you really notice it when you're kind of boondocking through the trees and stuff but even even after if you got nice runners on in a hard packed trail when you go into it you're not fighting to initiate that corner so it's it's very comfortable in that regards and then how the gas tank is sculpted you can see like as i'm standing you know basically it's a taper so you don't get into the edge of the gas tank with your legs it really allows you to kind of move around on the sled and even how this seat works it's high enough that it really puts you in control when you're riding you can you can see your tips very well and you kind of see what the front end's doing and it just it really it's i guess it's kind of almost like riding a dirt bike sometimes how it feels when you're going through the bumps and stuff um, and then the tunnel edge tunnel edges are super grippy they're a long fiber composite with some pretty big openings so when you're going through the through the deep snow and they start wanting to pack in it's super easy just to brush them off or or even you can feel how grippy it is with your boots so that's kind of the key when you're in the deeper snow that you want that grip because um, you're hanging onto the sled and you're using your body so it doesn't work very good if you all of a sudden slip off um, so it cleans out the running boards well provides grip and then on the right we also use the mountain skis which work really good for getting off trail but how the keel works it really grabs as well in the deeper mealier snow um, this design couldn't be possible without our laydown engine we've taken taken the engine which is already pretty far back because it's a laydown engine meaning the exhaust and the intake point to the front um, so it gets back as is physically as far possible closest to the rider as you can but with how our, our pipe works and wraps around it it really maintains that weight 
um, in a nice tight package close to the rider. And then the hood and how the hood works with our air intake. Basically, it draws, draws the air from up high so you can keep it clean. And then it comes back through. It's part of the hood and then filters into the intake and provides the, the air that the engine needs. The other big thing with this sled is our, our torque control link that ties our drive and driven clutch together, our adapt drive and driven clutch. Um, really keeps that constant bent belt tension belt life has been very good with it um, also the response that you get when you're just driving slow and you get on the gas you can really feel it engage um, very smoothly uh, because of that idler bearing that we have in our in our drive clutch it keeps a very tight belt so you don't have to worry about you know as the belts wear in that adjusting your deflection or anything because it's constant so it'll always maintain the right belt deflection um, our belt drive on the Arctic Cat belt drive that that we incorporated instead of the chain has been very good for getting the power to the ground. Uh, it's a lightweight system, very durable, very low maintenance. There's no need to adjust the belt. It's set in the tension that it's supposed to be based on the ratio it is. If you desire to change the ratio, ratio there's different settings. Um, that it's just it's an eccentric bearing on top So you just take some some bolts out and you turn it and you can get your belt off change the gearing put it back on Super easy to do um, It's proven to be very durable. So we're pretty excited about that and uh, Yeah, there's there's a bunch of cool features in it. I'm probably missing a few but um, re Really excited to get people on the sleds, you know having today with the with you guys getting a chance to ride the snowmobiles has been really fun because this is kind of our baby and and we we think a lot about it so when we get other people to ride it and they kind of say the same things that we think it just really reinforces that we're on the right track so appreciate you guys to be able to come and give us the feedback and we look forward to getting this this uh, platform out to a lot of demo events this late winter and early spring so get get more butts on seats so Perfect. all right